Hello, everybody. Welcome to the Lamley YouTube channel here on Monday. It is a holiday here in the United States. And we have a live unboxing today's Hot Wheels 2019 L case unboxing live is brought to you, of course, by AJ Toys. Ken sent this case to me to preview for you, and that is what we are going to do right now. We did a JK short card unboxing yesterday, and now it is time to take a look at this L case. This is an LU code. I don't think any of that really matters, but let's just get right to it. You guys can open this along with me. Saying, seeing a lot of you guys saying hi. I'm saying hi back to all of you. I know sometimes you like a shout out. It's hard for me to do when I'm trying not to cut my finger opening a box, but uh, that is done. All right, let's open this up. This is the latest case. So we're at L, so we have an M case coming. N, we'll skip O because it looks too much like zero. That's why they don't do that case. And then we will finish off with uh, P case and then Q case, and then we're done. Isn't that crazy? Already done with the um, 2019, then on to 2020. All right, let's just get right to it. We will start with the Street Creeper, and then it is the 2019 Mercedes-Benz A-Class, and then we finish off with the Island Hopper. I am going to do, I'm gonna probably post tomorrow a full highlight video. Street Creeper, if this had rubber tires, of course, would be the Super Treasure Hunt, but it does not, so this is just the standard one. It's this Mercedes-Benz A-Class, which is the surprising one. I was talking to the designer of it. He was like, I don't know if it would be a big hit, but it seems to be so far. And uh, I agree with him. It is. This one seems to have a little bit of a of a tire issue. You can see the back tire seems to be a little, uh, a little messed up. But uh, I have another one for the feature if that one is messed up. All right. Let's keep going. Looks like they've had a little bit of a mix-up there. There we go. Minecart is back. Bone shaker in gray. I think that's a holdover from the last case. I'll try and fix the lighting here. When you do it live, you just got to go with what you got. All right, Land Rover Series 3 pickup in blue. This was supposed to be in the um, last case. I opened the K case, but it was not in the assortment that I had, so now we have it. So I'll feature this one as part of the L case highlight video. Uh, Volkswagen K4 Racer in black, the Moon Eyes, that seems to be a little bit more of a holdover than it should be, but uh, that's okay. And then here is the Fast Bed Hauler. It is the treasure hunt, as you can see, for this case. And it's a cool treasure hunt. They've done some really nice treasure hunts this year. This is similar to the uh, Matchbox. There's a Matchbox Hauler. I think I've got a... Uh, I don't know if I have it in front of me. But it's the same kind of thing. This has a movable... I'll do this in the highlight video. It actually has a movable bed, so it works really well. So, functional treasure hunt. Okay, 2010 Ford Shelby GT500 Super Snake. Two of those in Hot Wheels racing colors. I really like the gold addition to that. Here's the eruption. Another one that was not in the K case that I opened, but is in this L case, is the 2017 Acura NSX in blue. Really good, really clean. That's an instant addition to the collection. And there's the diaper dragger. Zoom in. A lot of people are saying that one's hanging because no one has that camera. I get that. 1970 Ford Escort, Ford Escort RS 1600. This is the uh, from the Gumball 3000 series. Recolor in black. I like that tan color of the black one's really, really nice as well. A lot of escorts these days, right? Okay, Dodge Charger stock car. That looks kind of nice. NASCAR looking uh, race car. Two of those. And then the 32 Ford, which is just beautiful in that gold color. Yeah, some of you are commenting right now that it's a peg warmer. Dodge Challenger SRT Demon. That was the Super in the last case. Two of those in this case. So if you're looking for the regular one, I think there's only one per case in the last one I had. So you're going to be fine getting that in the I Believe, which is crazy looking alien thing, maybe. Who knows? 
I believe makes me think X Files and all that stuff. Street Wiener, two of those, and another diaper dragger. One of you made a comment I saw earlier about the Drifsta. Someone wanted me to photograph this. It's in the Hot Wheels Racing Colors. It is an unlicensed casting, but it's a cool casting. And you are right. This is really good looking. Um, that blue that they're using, that base blue, and the gold trim really makes these pop. I think Leeway's in charge of that deco, and he did a really nice job in the Grupo times 24. Aha! Okay. This is a holdover from the last case as well, but nice to see two because the K case I had only had one of the red Nissan 300ZX. This one thankfully has two. So again, if you missed if you missed this in the K case, you're going to find it, I hope, in the L case. And then what's that? The Heavy Hitcher. Any damage on the T-top? Someone's asking. I don't see. I don't see any damage. You guys, it's a little dusty on the top, so it's hard to tell, but no, I don't see any T-top damage on that one. Has there been? Has that been a thing? I haven't heard that. Um, okay. All right. Mad props. Also in the Hot Wheels racing. That's nice looking. A lot of people dig that casting. I think that looks really cool with the white top and the uh, racing bottom. 64 Chevy Nova, Chevy Nova Wagon which is a similar casting to the uh, Gasser and then the TV series Batmobile. So recolor on the Batmobile. This time it looks like in the standard Batmobile colors, but with these blue flames added to it. So that's really cool looking. Really nice sitting on the five spokes. Okay, that's the first 36. Let's go to the next 36. I actually spent last night photographing a ton of these models, including several from the L case because Wheel Collector sent these to me. And uh, the first feature on the A-Class and some of the other white vehicles, like, uh, anyway, the BMW or some other, not BMW, the uh, Tesla and some others, that's already up on LamleyGroup.com. You should guys go and look at that because the pictures are pretty cool. Fast Fish, old classic. And then the Fast Master. So this is the Fast Trio right there. Speaking of white cars, that's the theme today. Two Skull Crushers and then the recolor of the Cool Combi. Looks good in white, Magnus Deco on it, Urban Urban Outlaw, Magnus Walker Deco on the combi. That looks nice. Ah, here's a nice little trio. Dragon Tail, not so much. Oh, it's not my style. But these two are nice, huh? A little European classic right here. You've got the 84 Audi Sport Quattro in green. We won't call it British Racing Green because it's not a British car, but that rally style you could kind of go that route, right? And then uh, the 2016 BMW M2. Pretty plain on the front and back. I wish we would have at least headlights on it because you have the BMW logo. But the uh, racing stripes look cool. Obviously, the BMW colors there. So cool from the side, maybe not as much from the front and back. Okay, Hot Wheels Pursuit and the Fast Gassin. Fifty-six Ford F one hundred, which looks really cool, in the art car series. Look at that top of that thing; that is just cool. Two of those, and then the Corvette C seven R, also in Hot Wheels racing colors, looks good. Some recolors coming. First, the Lamborghini Countach police car in blue and uh, and white, and then the King Cuda in gray, also with the Magnus Walker. Deco. Classic 55 Nomad. Looking nice and rusty. Two of those. And then another 32 Ford. All right. Another one that was only, I think, one per case in the K case comes two per case now. 64 Nova Wagon Gasser. It's been a big hit. Those of you who have been finding the K cases have been finding at least telling me that this thing and the and the red Z are gone when they when you get there. So hopefully you're lucky enough to find this one. Never fear, it'll be in the L case and it'll be two per case. Hector's asking for me to open the RLC 240Zs. I might this week, I might not. I have some things to do with them and once I have those, then I will do it. I've got some cool stuff for you on that. 2019 Ford Ranger Raptor, holdover from the last case, two of those. And then the speed, 
what is that, Speed Spider? Do I put these out of the blisters? No, most of these, what I do with these cases is I pull out the models I want to feature, add to the collection, then I box these up and I take them to the children's hospital. That is where these go. Quick Bite and the uh, Roger Dodger 2.0. Okay, okay. All right. Look at this. We really, look at what's in this case. We should have saved some pretty monster, pretty monster castings for last. Porsche Panamera, Porsche Panamera Turbo, SE Hybrid Sport Turismo. This is a cool car. Have you seen any, any of these new Panameras with the kind of the more wagon back to them on the road? These are fantastic. And this casting is fantastic. I opened this up to photograph it. Um, Lindsay, the designer, did this one, and I would love to get her thoughts on it because she nailed it. It is absolutely perfect. Look at the look at the rear on that, all the detail, all the Porsche detail, and then the uh, headlights are part of the um, or the window piece. So they and then they put the logo there on the hood. That is a fantastic casting, a surprisingly uh, a surprising. Uh, Front runner for me in terms of casting of the year, in terms of quality. There's so many good ones. The Z is going to win for me. I, I'll say this right now, but this one is a surprise. Um, as like, uh, anyway, I'll stop talking. I'll do that in the feature. And then 91 Mazda MX-5 Miata, which is also a neat little new model from the last case. But that, trust me, pick one of these up. It's really good. And that color, all right, really fond of that one. That's my favorite of this case, I think. And then this one, which a lot of you guys are excited about, the 2016 Lamborghini Centenario Roadster. That is also clean, clean, clean. Details in the front, details in the back, which Hot Wheels has been doing. I photographed this one, too. The Panamera that A-Class photographed all of them. And boy, they're pretty. Maybe I'll put some of these on my Lamley Extras channel. Two of those in this case. So two Panameras, two of these in this case. That is nice to see. And then the Hyper Rocker. But there you go. I got the A-Class buried somewhere, so I'm not gonna try and get it out, but I would say the highlights for me, A-Class, the Red Z, but that's a holdover from the last case. But these two, definite, definite highlights for this case. The Porsche and the Lamborghini. There's your winner right there. I'd put that one in a Sterling protector right now if you wanna keep the artwork, but that is a very, very cool model. All right, guys, that is your 2000 19 L case. I got all the things falling. There's some Tomic Limited Vintage. All right. That's your unboxing for now. We got highlights tomorrow. I've got other videos to do that you will like. Yes, that little car in the background will get opened eventually, but I got some things to do with it. So that will be really, really fun. Guys, stay tuned. Seven o'clock every night, mountain time, whatever that equates to in your area. Be ready. I got some stuff dropping. Really, really fun. Make sure you subscribe because I know people are supposed to tell you that and I don't, but I'm glad you do. Thanks, everybody. Have a great holiday. See you tomorrow. Bye.